before you head out of town for the holiday weekend or you leave for your summer vacation, you may want to make sure your home doesn't become the target of burglars. Our Shea Smith sat down with the lead burglary detective for Tulsa Police to get some advice on ways to keep your home safe while you're away. With many traveling for the holiday weekend and several weeks of summer left, burglars could be on the lookout for homes when no one's home. Typically, the, the residential burglaries are occurring during the day. But there are ways to protect your home from an outsider trying to get in. You can't always 100% protect yourself. You can make things a lot harder for people to, to make entry into your house. That's like uh, securing your doors better so somebody can't just walk up and kick it with one kick. If you use longer screws or something in the in the catch plate that will actually go in the wood in the wall and it's a lot harder for people to get inside your house. Some important tips when it comes to protecting your home from burglars. Always lock the top and bottom locks on your doors. Invest in some sort of security system and have a security system sign in your front yard. Also, cameras. Lieutenant Means says he's seen several surveillance videos of people snooping around homes until they see a tiny camera staring back at them and then they leave. Lieutenant Means also says get to know your neighbors. And trust your neighbors and, and let them know, hey, I'm going to be out of town. Nobody should be here. But if a burglar is still able to get inside your home, there are ways to make sure they don't take off with any of your belongings. Any small items, jewelry, valuables, it, you know, it's always a very good idea to have yourself a safe. And if you have a safe, you want to make sure you secure it down. Don't have a small safe that's easily carried by somebody. Lieutenant Means also says have a list of the serial numbers for your electronics and other important items. That way, if a thief tries to pawn them, they will be flagged in the pawn shop and police will be contacted. Shay Smith, 2 News, Oklahoma.